charge a cavalry unit in there to just kind of eliminate those guys before they cause any more trouble. Okay, yes, that is a lot of damage. All right, stop, though. Okay, guys, welcome to the battle. The hills are covered with the dust clouds of our enemies. We have uh, a couple of units in Skillthrum formation that are kind of arranged right here. Basically, I'm going to let them pour forward a little bit before opening fire with our archers, which are on either flank, and the mangonels, which are just behind our infantry here. Oh, here comes a bodyguard unit. All right, let's have the mangonels open fire back here, and actually, let's have the archers just kind of fire at will. Actually, no. The enemy king lies dead, slain by our gallant warriors. Attack while his men mourn their loss. All right, let's have the archers fire. Oh crap! What the heck just happened? How did our mangonels fire a shot that close in front of them? Wait a minute, how did these guys all die back here? Okay, I have no idea what just happened. The enemy is badly blotted. They have lost half their men. No, seriously, I, I have no idea what just happened. Somehow, our mangonels landed a shot. I mean, even more directly in front of them than I would have thought was possible. Okay, mangonels, go ahead and fire on them now. And let's have our archers open fire as well. Oh. charge a cavalry unit in there to just kind of eliminate those guys before they cause any more trouble. Okay, yes, that is a lot of damage. Alright, stop, though. Alright, have you driven off those guys? Okay, it looks like it. Alright, mangonels now fire on, let's say, these guys way in the back. Archers, you guys can fire, well, some of you can fire, on these guys back here. Right there. Okay, there we go. Ah, excellent, yes. Burn the Mongols to death. Oh, uh, General, get over here to keep up morale. Spielman. Spielman. Okay, Manganels. Okay, they do seem to still be firing on guys that are back here. Oh, why isn't this unit? Oh, oh, fire arrows. That's why they were using fire arrows. I was wondering about that. Okay, fire on these guys here. Manganels, fire on these guys back here, so any shots, you know, can kind of just land amongst them back there. Okay, that's a little unfortunate. Fuck. 
Pray something changes in the course of battle, for defeat seems almost certain. Okay, let's charge a couple more infantry units forward, because one of our units is getting crushed up there. They have lost half their men. Actually, here, you guys get back here because we're losing that Manganel unit. Actually, we're kind of losing this one too. Wait, why are you guys moving? Alright, we need to fire some arrows directly into here. Because most of this is actually not our troops at all. Most of this is just the enemy. In fact, we could even fire somewhat in the rear here. All right, you know what, Manganels? First off, grab your Manganel again and treat back here just a bit. All right, let's get a Spearman unit in over here. Let's make sure the archers are still firing that guy's kind of in the rear back here. Let's pray it remains as such. Okay, yes. Archers are now firing in the rear. Very good. Oh, what are those guys doing? Go and make sure they continue to rout. Half the enemy force remains. They are attacking us. We are All right. Archers, stop firing over there. And start firing at these guys once they come within range, which admittedly... Seriously, our archers are out of range, but theirs... Oh, well, I guess ours are a little further back, aren't they? Okay. Let's form up our three units here. Let's take these guys out of Skillthrum. And pull them back. You guys, cavalry, get over there and chase after them. Oh, dear. They have guys firing at us from over there. All right, archers, fire over here. You archers, fire over there. Get the mangonels kind of forward again. Wait, are there enemies here? No, I don't think there are. Okay. Oh! Those are rockets! Unfortunately, the rockets actually seem somewhat effective. But I think they're hitting their own guys, too. Alright, you guys. Get in there. Archers, continue just as much fire as you can on those guys. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Alright, we'll have the Manganels just fire as far back as they can in the hopes that we don't hit our own guys. Back there, please. Yeah, they're definitely hitting their own guys a fair bit. <laughs> but they are also hitting our guys, unfortunately. Oh, oh! No, no, our guys do not charge across there. Stay under this metric ton 
huge pile of bodies. Oh, the enemy is mostly retreating. Okay, um, Anganels. Get back here. Cavalry across the river. Actually, let's grab... Mm, where are the nearest cavalry units? I, I, I sent them all to attack retreating units. Okay, get across the river there and attack. We'll send uh, we'll send these units first. Okay, all three enemy generals are dead. That's good. Oh, um, the infantry can move to the side here, or even back. Yes, there's still the trebuchet unit over there, too, so we'll want to take them out. Okay, now that we've got a couple of units crossing, we can send the general across as well. Fall back. No, no, don't fall back. Stay. S stick around here with us. All right, you guys go get them. Heavy cavalry. Actually, here. Form up over here, once you're all across, and let's see, you guys. The enemy flees the battle. Form up over here. Down those worthless peasants. Okay, now charge them. Oh, why don't we get on over here and take out this unit, too? Okay, they're routing. There are two units here. All right, go ahead and start working on them, or finish them off, I mean. Come on, guys. Get, get a move on. Get a move on. Go get them. All right, and then we've got these three cavalry units here, so let's get right up to them. We'll charge them down, too. All right, seriously, what are you guys doing? Get away from the edge if it's affecting you so much. guys are doing fine. All right, now charge into them. Okay, you know what? They're actually retreating now, I think. So let's get up here. Come on. Get a move on. Go faster. Oh, they're winded. That's not good. Heavy cavalry are slow enough as it is. All right, go get them. Go get them. Go get them. Did we kill off that unit? We did. Did we kill off that unit? We did. Okay, good. We caught them. Excellent. Now kill them all. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Our cowardly foe runs. We must. All right, good. Kill off as many of them as you can. Preferably all of them, but I see a couple of there are probably going to get away. Ready for them. The enemy are utterly vanquished. This is a great victory worthy of only the mightiest of generals. <laughs> it was certainly touch and go there for a while, in my most humble opinion. All right, let's check casualties. Wow, the Manganels did excellent. The Archers did excellent. The Hospitaller Sergeants. That unit in particular killed hundreds. Literally hundreds. Actually, we caught a lot of prisoners with the infantry as well. For once, they, they actually outnumber the prisoners taken by the cavalry. 
cavalry didn't inflict a lot of casualties, but they're important casualties because we eliminated lots of artillery units. Man, looking at our own casualties. Ow, 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 ow. I mean, yes, we got... Um, let's see, how many did... Okay, yes, we did get healing among some of these units, but dang. We still suffered an immense number of casualties amongst the sergeants. Especially when we blew up one of them with our own artillery, because somehow a mangonel unit dropped, like, the barrel directly in front of it. Like, how does that even work? All right, well, anyway, let's, uh, let's take this back to the campaign map.